Hello, I'm back and I'm trying Bola Pizza again. Handmade in Austin, Texas. This is the variety called lamb. Spiced lamb, cherry tomatoes, red onions, mozzarella, parmesan pizza. Defrost it and cook it for about seven minutes. There's the back. There is why it tastes so good. And their story. I've tried this once before. There's a close up of the ingredients. Alright. And it doesn't look like there's any sauce on this, but uh, and there's the nutrition. It's a bowl of pizza. Out of the oven and cut up. There's a close up. And the crust did not get very brown. Cooked it an extra two minutes. But there's the lamb pizza from Bola Pizza. So here it is. You saw the close up. The lamb pizza from Bola Pizza. I said I've had this before, but I've had Bola Pizza once. But I've never had this variety. And I'm really intrigued that it has lamb on it or lamb sausage so can't wait to try this All right. some cheese pool it's at the bottom did not get brown but let's give it a try All right, I like it's cheesy. It's a nice cheese pool and the lamb it tastes like almost like sausage, not like pork sausage, but it's a different kind of sausage. It's very good. The crust is kind of light and airy. There's no sauce on it. Crunchy. Hear that crunch? The bottom of the crust end of the crust looks like it wasn't done but it's done crunchy mm. so like I said there's no kind of sauce on here there's no olive oil just the strength of the toppings. And this lamb sausage is just has really good flavor. It doesn't taste gamey. Tiny tiny bit spicy. Like peppery. But uh yeah, this pizza is pretty good. I'm impressed. The lamb pizza uh, they sell Bola Pizza at HEB in the frozen aisle. It goes for eleven ninety nine. dollars uh, So it is really expensive. It was eleven ninety nine dollars last time I tried it. The price has stayed the same. I think that was a couple years ago. And uh, I was just shopping at a different HEB instead of the one I usually do. And I saw this one, Lamb. I had to have it. And now I'm trying it, and this one I would actually buy again, just because I've never seen lamb on a frozen pizza before. And this taste is phenomenal.
but next time this is a treat I'm not gonna buy it all the time but next time I'm gonna have uh, something on the side marinara sauce garlic sauce ranch something and let's try this tomato Just melts in my mouth. And tomato has a good bite too. Wow. So for eleven ninety nine, I think the lamb variety is worth it. Uh, it's still going to be a special purchase every now and then, but I highly recommend it. The sausage doesn't really taste like lamb at all. Definitely doesn't taste like pork or beef, but it's really good. You can't quite, if you didn't know it was lamb, you would assume it was beef, I guess. But uh, it's spicy, the tomatoes are juicy, the crust is, like I said, crispy and airy at the same time. And uh, don't let the light crust that didn't quite darken up fool you. It's really good. And... I'm going to, like I said, recommend it if you like lamb. Uh, but it is pricey. And I will buy it again. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.